guys and gals. I'm Brett Orison and I'm here with Jack White and the Boarding House Reach Tour 2018. And uh, I'm going to show you my gear I use. I'm using lots of Rupert Neve Designs gear, as you can tell. I will start with my vocal effects lines. I've got the Rupert Neve Master Bus Processor. This is going to be my drum vocal and my effects 2 vocal, which is a line coming from a pedal board that Jack has on stage. This actually, just putting it through here, kind of cleared things up, gave it what felt to me was just more of a dynamic range. Um, and I could do a little bit of compression without really hearing it. So. Up here are the shelfer channels. This guy on top is on Jack's center vocal, which is a clean vocal that I also use a tube tape echo and a uh, space echo RE201. So I'm coming in line level using this as an insert, and I'm basically doing some compression here, very mildly of course, and then uh, my EQing here. And another important thing about this guy is the high pass filter on this channel trumps any console high pass that I've heard. I'm not using the, uh, the texture at the moment, but occasionally if I'm in an arena or uh, something else and I need to uh, add a little bit of high end or smooth the high end out, make it a little bit more analog sounding, I'll, I'll just pop that in. I, you can see I run it pretty hot if I use it. Yeah, so then we come down here and I've got 18 of the 5043 compressors. They're really smooth. You almost don't really hear them. They seem to curate the low end in such a way that when you insert it and you take the insert out without doing anything to the compressor, something is more solidified in the low end when it's hitting the 5043. That's why I got 18 of them. And then also on stage, of course, we have 26 RNDIs. So then I have another master bus processor. This is on my left, right. Um, I'm using it at 100% blend, so it's all compressor. It's one of these compressors that you can tap the snare drum or whatever's loud and you don't, you're just not going to hear it. It's got the stereo field editor. If you need it, you can make your mix wider or you can bring in the middle of the mix, the center, or take it back. Um, you can do a lot with this. I don't use it a lot, but um, I have found on occasion in a weird room I can spread it out just a little bit with the width and it can help very much. Yeah, that's that's all my gear. That's that's all the Rupert Neve designs.